Good morning. This is the KSL Fastcast for Thursday, May 8th. I'm Cher Park. Here are the top local stories. The search is over for a 75 year old man who was missing overnight in the Mill Creek area. Unified police say a TV viewer found Joseph Alpin in the Salt Lake City area this morning. Police were concerned because of the weather and the fact that Alpin suffers from Alzheimer's and diabetes. But good news is he's now safe. Right now, police are searching for a man that stabbed a taxi driver overnight. The suspect stabbed the driver several times in the back in the parking lot at 9th West and 10th North. The injured taxi driver was taken to a hospital by a passerby. At this point, we don't know the driver's condition, but if you have any information about suspicious activity in that area overnight, please call police. And new this morning, it's good news for millions of car owners. General Motors says cars with recalled ignition switches can remain on the road. Now, the automaker says, says they have performed 80 tests and found that as long as your key ring only has a single key on it, then the flawed ignition switch shouldn't slip out of the run position. The automaker suggests that drivers remove everything from that key ring until it can fix the more than 2,000 or 2 million rather cars impacted by this recall. Now let's check out the Fastcast forecast for today. We still have some showers in the area. Salt Lake with a high of 61, Ogden 58, Provo 60, and St. George sunny at 76. And that's the KSL Fastcast for this Thursday. Have a good day.